What is up, boys and non-boys? Today, this is my first commentary slash story time. I'm going to be going over how I started YouTube, why I made a channel, and how it all began. So, the reason I'm on Pernicious is because that's the map of the Sam Green game. And before I get into this video, I just need to make something clear, okay, guys? I know I was joking about like gay people in the Sam Green video. But I have no problem with gay people. I'm, I don't hate if you, I don't hate you if you're gay. I have no issue with gay people, and that's mostly because uh, my friend, you might know him as Zach Araya. He's actually um bisexual, and he recently came out, or not? He didn't recently come out. He came out like around a year ago, and because of that, like I've learned to just open up and accept all genders. Oh, well, oh, poor technically skin. Anyways, so yeah, now that that's out of the way, I can get into where did he go? Okay, I can get into the actual part of the video about how it all began, how my, what made my IT channel, why I decided to do it, how I sniped Sammy, and just everything along those lines. So sit back, relax, and enjoy my first terrible video. So it all started when I just randomly queued a game. I don't think you understand. I did the slash play better underscore eight on a scroll command. Just as soon as I logged on, and I instantly queued Pernicious, and it turns out um, there was a Nick in there, and the Nick had a uh, distinct Nick. If you have um, had, and oh my God, gray and red are both gone. But if you have ever had a uh, MV Plus, you can pretty much tell when someone's a Nick, and if it's uh, like a YouTuber or not. So when I saw um, him, I was like, oh, that's a YouTuber, but. Sammy Green has a uh, black skin, and I don't really watch his videos a lot, but I know what, like, I knew the general concept of what his skin looked like, uh, and because of that, oh my god, pro player, oh, why would you do that? So because I knew what his skin looked like, and he was using a similar skin to what his uh, skin on his main account looks like, I just put two and two together and was like, hmm, that's, uh, that's Sammy Green. What, did I know a Sammy Green from the start? I did not. But, I guess we'll just keep White alive so we can just play with them. They look kind of funny anyway. Like, I'm not gonna get my bed. Uh, I'm just gonna go over you. Oh my god, get reeled. And I'm running away. Anyways. So, what happened? Well, I decided that I was just gonna have some fun with um the Sammy Green. I was gonna just troll him, joke around with him, make him laugh. The reason I chose to joke about gay people is because I know like Sammy Green, Chaz, and Gene Wadey, they all find um that type of stuff humorous in a way, as you saw in the video, like he was laughing, enjoying kind of enjoying himself. He had to like kinda of hold back his laughter so he wouldn't get cancelled. But yeah, you could definitely tell he was uh enjoying my epic jokes. And this guy's gonna get, I just got railed. Get away from me. Easy. 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 And you're gone. Oh my god. Hitboxes. Hitbox moment. So, the game wasn't really that much to talk about in the game. It's about what happened after the game to talk about. It's just the fact that he made, like, he actually. I uploaded a video of himself losing against me, and I was, I was like, oh my god, no way, I felt like the center of the world, okay guys, I was like the center of attention, I was flexing to all my friends, my friends were bragging people about, hey guys, you know my, my, my one of my friends was the person in Sam Green's video, I would join her pixel lobbies, and I would be showered with praise, praises, and I'm also a ton of death threats, but that's besides the point, okay, we don't, I don't really care about that. And then one of my friends, you may know him as Havex, he left the channel, but he did kind of come back to the channel. Uh, he has a lot of schoolwork and stuff, but he convinced me to make a YouTube channel where people, where we would just uh, stream up YouTubers and stuff like that. Uh, there was only one issue. I didn't know how to stream snipe. <laughs> oh my god, that's kind of funny. I didn't really know how to stream snipe. Um. That and that's because there is no admin that got me into Sammy Green's game. There is no uh, tracker. <laughs> I just had I had randomly queued his game out of nowhere. Like I had randomly queued his game as I said before. 
There's no corrupt staff member that helped me. There's nothing like that. Um, so after I made a YouTube channel and then I uploaded my POB there, Sammy Green asked, he saw the video because I kept commenting on his channel, telling him to look at my channel. So he actually saw the video and I noticed because he had added it, he saved it to his playlist, his montage playlist. He had saved my video to, um, to his montage playlist by mistake. That's happened to me before. Well, I'll just press save for later and it'll save to my live stream playlist when I used to have a live stream playlist. So yeah, he accidentally, um, saved the video. Um, to his live stream playlist, which actually which got like around 700 people to find my video when it went live because so many people saw it, it had like 700 views in the first day, and I was like, oh my god, I'm so famous, guys! Everybody should worship me. But sadly, it was quite the opposite. I got the amount of um hate comments I got on the day uh, on the daily was incredible. I know he told people not to give me hate, but you know if someone sees you using a hack client. They're gonna immediately um, associate you as the worst thing to ever walk this world. And don't worry, I got you, butt, bro. And that's exactly what happened. Um, they saw he people his fans saw that I was on vape client, and they're like, "Oh my god, how dare you? How dare you wrong me? How dare I fall off there?" They're like, "How dare you wrong me? How dare you cheat on my favorite YouTuber? You're a villain, and I'm a hero by giving you death threats." And I was like, oh my god, guys, don't give me death threats. But really, uh, I was a very special person back then. And I so am. I'm still a very special human being. I love toxicity. I, I devour it. When someone's talking to me, it just makes me feel good. Because it shows that I made them mad. And that I win. They they're just have the result of being toxic because they're mad. And that's exactly what happened in the comments. On like our first 20 videos that I uploaded on the channel... The comments were just filled with toxicity. YouTubers were like, oh my god, they're so bad. I survived so long against them. But really, uh, we kind of just let them live. So, there's that. And then something mysterious happened. Sammy Green ran out of content or ideas for his video. So, he uploaded a second video um, on us. Which got us to about a thousand subscribers. And like, got us monetized in one week. We got monetized in YouTube in one week. You don't really make a lot of money from YouTube if you um, upload copyrighted music like we do in our videos. But it's still, like, we get some so we can buy alts. Oh my god! Can they stop? <laughs> they killed me. Like, I could use anti KB and not, and not die. But it's just the fact that I'm just, just chilling, man. I'm just chilling. I know you didn't even buy Gap. Well, after uh, Sam we uploaded the second video, people flooded to our channel. And that's kind of when uh, we started taking off. We uh, we did not work away from the ground. We did not work away from nothing. We were not self-made. We received a shout from Sam Green and about, I think, yeah, like 1% of Sam Green's fans actually liked, um, I guess, cheating content. So we got like a thousand subscribers in the first week. And then after that, it was just kind of slow selling um, from then. But slowly after slowly... The comments actually uh, turned up. Like, the this, this comments and the, the video feedback started turning up. Instead of people being so toxic and being like, Oh my god, you're such a bad person. Go end yourself. People were actually like, Oh my god, nice video. And instead of me reading uh, comments to um, like feel like, Haha, you're so toxic because you're mad. And they just disconnected. I guess they were kind of mad. Um, Just cue like a bridge duel. Just do UHC. Do something like that. Uh, so there. Nowadays, I actually look at comments to feel good. Like when, if I'm feeling bad, I'll look at comments to feel good about myself. Not about myself, but I just feel good in general. I'll do two v two. I'll two v two. But yeah, I'll look at comments just to feel good. Um, because yeah, I feel good now when I read the comments. Cause, like we actually have a good uh people that good viewer base, good people that watch us. It's all, mostly all of the um toxic uh thirteen year olds that would send death threats to me on the daily have i guess decided that they're not going to get me to quit youtube a lot of people don't understand sarcasm either and i gotta think of what else to be honest my inventory is not even i'm one person he's gonna i'm just the best player well if you guys enjoy my care about commentary Make sure you comment something about Zach. Show him, show, give him support for being gay, guys. He it took him. It was a long time for him to come out. 
So, yeah, that's going to be it for my for this commentary. If you did like it, make sure you uh, smack a like on the video, boys and non-boys. Um, and yeah, that's it.